Okay, in this video what I want to do is to uh, have a go at um, showing you how I set up um, working out a tune from scratch. Uh, this is a tune I haven't practiced. I have no idea how this is going to work out, so I'm just coming into it cold as I would normally do. Uh, it's a tune I wrote down for uh, an idea that I think I'll have a go at producing that. And uh, so I'm going to start off. Um, so I know da 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 da. So it's da 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 da. Yeah, so that's my melody. So if you can remember your melody, that's easy. If you can't remember the melody, then what you need to do is write out the tab. So write all that out in one go. And when you've got your tab, then you can start from there. So I'm not going to write the tab out. I'm going to just try and work it out on the fly. But for you, it might be different. So what I'm doing, I'm going to... So I'm straight away thinking, well, I mean... I've got a C chord, so I'm, I've either got da da, not quite right. So I think quite often I end up with an F with a C chord. Da, 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 da. worked out um, I've got an F with a C chord attached and then I'm going to end up in a D minor so that's a G7 with a C Gotta work that bit out as well, but the beginning. Doesn't sound quite right, but at the moment I'm gonna go with it and I'll see it, what I have to work out afterwards. So, so I've got I've changed from uh, G7 to I don't know uh, something uh, part of a G I don't know So that's close. So that's my first point. So I know I've got 
some more work to do on that. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to stop the video there, I'm going to go away and have a little play, and I'll come back and tell you how I got on with the rest with the next bit. Okay, what I've uh, had a little play with is the... Uh, Da 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 And that bit I I could play da 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 Or I could play it in pinches. Working that out sounds reasonable. I'm not quite sure about the, the B flat. This bit. Not sure. I might just do. That to me sounds better. where I am with this. So I think that's reasonable so far. I'll have a break there and come back and tell you about the rest of it. So now I've got um, the arrangement fairly much sorted in my head. What I now do to go and check is go and have a look at some uh, um, sheet music with some chords and just to check if there's any chords that I'm missing. Um, the music that I was looking at is all written in F which is what I'm written, uh, what I've arranged mine in. But there is one little bit um, which I hadn't sorted out which was a, a C7 which I play as a, um, a three on the uh, G string, third fret on the G string, and that fits in with the uh, with the um, do 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 do. I hadn't really got in the arrangement and so stage one sort out the melody stage two uh, work out what the chords are in your own head or you could just go directly and get the chords um, from uh, the internet just search for the, the song and the chords uh, make sure they're in the key that you want them and just to try and work around the chords that you've got the arrangement I got it's got an, a, an F add nine I'm assuming the F add nine is, is the is the one with the C, um, which is this one, which is an F with an added C on it, third fret on the uh, A string. And um, so I've used that chord instinctively. Uh, and a D minor 7, which is down there. And da 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 That's my arrangement at the moment and I'll go away and have a practice and try and put all that together but that's the workings of um, how, I, how I make an arrangement. I hope you enjoyed it. Okay so having about uh, a day's practice, probably played it maybe 20 times, maybe 30 times. Um, I'm at this stage so there'll be some errors in here but uh, um, I haven't written this out anywhere, this is just all from memory so um, I'm playing this at 100 beats a minute just to keep it nice and slow. So if you want to set a timer and have a go at doing it, you can do. So here we go.
that's uh, a day's practice. I'm sure with uh, a bit more practice I can play some extra twiddly bits in there, but as far as I'm concerned, that's as much as I need to do. And so that's taking you from the start of an idea of a song or a tune through the picking process, the mistakes, uh, looking for chords, um, making sure you get the melody right. I think most of that's probably okay. I'm sure um, if I go back and listen to the song, which I haven't done at all, um, I'd probably find some extra bits in there. But as far as I'm concerned, um, that's a wrap. And I uh, hope you enjoyed that process. <laughs>